Okay, so starting back here is the Super Mario World 2 World of Nintendo sign. Super Mario Brothers 2, sorry. And right back here is the Pikmin keychains that I have. A bunch of different Pikmin keychains. The Phantom Hourglass Legend of Zelda plush keychain set. Final Fantasy series keychains and straps. And right along here is one of my favorite sets, the Final Fantasy VI keychains. You can see all the every character is even Kefka is there. And then we go to Final Fantasy VII keychains. Some of these are very detailed, some of these aren't. Um, the Final Fantasy VIII set is very well detailed. And then the Final Fantasy IX set is very well detailed as well. Love that Steiner figure right there. I also have Chrono Cross right here, or Chrono Trigger, and some Chrono Cross. And Chocobo's Dungeon, yeah, some keychains from that. And on top of here are some random Mario unpainteds, or semi-painteds. Some Kingdom Hearts stuff. Tom Nook plush. Um, this is a musical battery-operated Mario Kart toy. And the Mario Kart, I'm sorry, the Super Mario um, furniture that is meant to house your NES. And some Dixie Cup holders down there. The Experience Wii GameStop sign. A Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess lunchbox tin that houses um, Wii accessories. This is the Dunlop tennis ball. It's foam, so it's disappointing for the uh, tennis rackets I have. The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess standee. On top of that are the Final Fantasy III trading arts figures that I got from Square Shop. Super Mario Galaxy Red Star Mario. There's a Mario standee back here. Along with the Mario um, air pushing toy and the Mario, uh, very old Mario inflatable back there. It's kind of out of air. In the Final Fantasy IX box is a Vivi statue and the box below that, you can kind of see it back there, is my life-sized Mr. Saturn plush. You can see S Cargo Express. He stays in his box. There's a couple other, there's the Mario Tennis rackets I have. And World of Nintendo sign. Pat upon keychain figures or straps. And some other Nintendo 64 memorabilia back there. Mario Kart Advance or Mario Brothers Advance um, dartboard. Mario 3 on 3 basketball hoop. Super Mario World maze and some other new Super Mario Brothers stuff. Uh, here's the extremely rare Mario Kart 64 set from Video Game Superstars. Uh, from Toy Biz. And they have the complete set on card as well as loose. Diddy Kong Racing and some Crash Bandicoot figures. Then up here I have the Joyride figures. Mario Sunshine with Yoshi. Uh, Link and Epona on the horse. Or Link on Epona. Uh, Luigi's Mansion figure. Samus figure. All very rare on card. Marvel vs. Capcom with Mega Man. I like that Mega Man figure, even though it was weird to have the his X transformation was very weird in the game. Uh, here's some more Mega Man figures, starting with the ones from the show. Rush, Snake Man, and Drill Man are very rare. The Retro Roto series, very well made. I wish they would have continued that. Um, and some of the Jazzwares figures that I liked. Rush, Proto Man, Cut Man, Quick Man, the Mega Man Zero, Zero version 2 figure just Mega Man Zero, and the Command Mission X. Then we have some Mario, old Mario on-card vehicle figures. Up here is the, whoops, my light went out. So let me get that. Okay, um, here's the Kingdom Hearts set. Right along here, Trading Arts. And we see Play Arts Dragon Quest Eight figures, all four. Along the edge there is a Super Mario World pin set. The complete Final Fantasy IX figure set. Large figures. And these two are very rare. It goes 1, 2, Roman numeral 3, Roman numeral 4. So these came out at several times. And the Final Fantasy Monster Collection. A couple of guys there. Sephiroth and Cloud. Minimates. 
And this standee back here is actually just Mario, Link, and Banjo. And I've added Kirby, Fox, and Samus cutouts to it. And the Master Sword replica is over there. And uh, Bomberman Bomb, a Bob Bomb from Mario Kart Wii, Excite Truck, and uh, Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess box promos, inflatable chain chomp, a couple of Starman sounds plushes. One is a sample, which makes it more rare if it hadn't have been faked constantly. Uh, GameCube lights. We have a couple of more sound plushes. Some mushrooms from the Super Mario Galaxy set. There's Toad in the box. Large Donkey Kong. Legend of Zelda trash can. And a this is another promo prototype I picked up. A Super Mario Brothers dart, ball dart safe target game. And over here is a Mario Kart DS um, loop track. And it has Wario and Mario. And then up here on the desk we have the Mario 3 talking sign, Game Boy Color promos, the ugly Halloween masks, Mario and Luigi 3 pipe telescopes or periscopes, uh, some Mario and Luigi 3 stylus, styli, my gold Mario statue I moved, the archery kit from Legend of Zelda, I've done a video on that, done a video on the um, classic NES series retail kit and some of the liquor items and the Mario Kart license plate from Mario Kart Wii and there's this is the Furuta um, set and I'll do a video on that once I complete all three I have the first two completed and I'm waiting on one figure and then Mario records and then I have the uh, Mario and Yoshi scooter from Super Mario World and there's the, um, whoops, sorry. There's the top of it and the handle. And then a quick little Wind Waker promo strap from a magazine, Nintendo Dream magazine, I think. And the wall stickers that are mint on card. And then I have a Nintendo sign on the hanging on the back of the chair. So that's it, except for the case. Oh, I have this along the edge here. Rabbit's figures, the Mario figures, I hung my Boo plush, and there's a Game Boy Advance promo sign and my coin block that makes noise. Um, here's the Series 2 set of figures. A couple other figures here, a sound keychain, some pins. Uh, my pin collection is right here. Very expensive pin collection. Video game pins are pretty rare. And here's some more rare pins. Uh, keychain and then the pewter figures right there. And then we have the uh, stuff on the ceiling which is the Mario banner and there's the Star Fox 64 R Wing, my Mario Mobile, and uh, various character cutouts. There's my Super Mario 64 or Super Mario Galaxy Flying Mario plush link and various other character cutouts. Maybe my favorite pose for Mario, Mario 3. So I think that's everything except for the case. Uh, there's a couple of Twilight Princess posters, Mario cutout, um, my Kirby keychain set, some other Mario sprites up here, Mario Brothers marquee, woo, and uh, Mar uh, Wario and Mario, ooh, hanging blue shell, just hung that yesterday. And the magnet set over there. So, another quick pan of the room, and I'll do the case for you uh, for the last video. Thank you.